Did you know that you can unlock your car and start it without using a key? In fact, with your key fob in your pocket or purse, you can unlock the doors, start the ignition, and lock all of your doors. Let me explain. To unlock your doors, just grab a front door handle, being sure not to touch the lock and unlock sensor simultaneously, then pull, and you're in. To lock your doors, simply press the sensor on the door handle for about a half a second. It'll have ridges or a square sensor, like this. When you hear them click, you'll know they're locked. Or you can press the lock unlock button on the inside door panel before closing the door and it will automatically lock. You can also open your trunk or lift gate without using the key by pressing the soft button switch located either just above or below the license plate or in the lift gate handle. To start your vehicle, once inside, just press and hold the brake pedal while you push the engine start stop button. To turn it off, be sure the vehicle is in park and push the start stop button again. If at any time the battery in your remote dies or the signal is interrupted, you can use the removable key inside to unlock the driver's door. Just press the button and slide the key out. Next, insert the key into the slot located underneath the rear of the driver's door handle and push up until you feel the internal tab flex and unlock the plastic bezel. Slide the bezel back to completely remove it. When you do, you'll be able to access the key cylinder and unlock your door. To replace the bezel, slide it forward until you feel it snap into the lock position. Once you're in, there's a pocket in the center console made just for the key fob. It'll allow you to start your car. Place the key fob in the slot with the buttons facing up and the unlock button towards the front of the vehicle. Keep in mind, because the key is programmed to your car, if you lose it, you'll need to contact your dealer for a replacement. One more thing, to help prevent locking the key fob inside of the vehicle when using the door lock, depending on how the vehicle is set up, if left inside, you may hear a horn chirp indicating the fob has been left in the vehicle and the doors will not lock. 